Hello everybody, welcome back to more Enter the Gungeon mod, the Gungeon, we're gonna be doing a rainbow run. <laughs> Gotta make it rhyme. <laughs> make it rhyme, idiot, do it. Do it, I don't wanna. Alright, we're gonna <laughs> play a gunslinger rainbow run. <laughs> oh boy. These always go off the rails here, and I imagine today is gonna be no different. The modded rainbow runs, you know, like, yes, they also give you a little bit of a weird issue because a lot of times, you know, rainbow runs have some ammo capacity woes. I mean, obviously, like, if we wanted to win, we would pick Gunther. Otherwise, uh, let's take a, let's take a peek here. What was the bubble item again? I think that it is, oh boy, oh boy. Where even is it? What is the bubble item? Is it a risk of rain? I don't know. I don't want to sit here for too long and just uh, just scroll through this, but I'm pretty sure we've had it before. Yeah, there it is. Bashful shots. Okay, they don't like other items getting in the way. Okay. Stronger based off of how few, how many, uh, like a few items you have. It's not a bad idea. But I also kind of like the idea of uh, big, big laser. Let's go with big, big laser for now. So, because that should make it so every once in a while, even this standard gun should shoot out big, big laser. You know, V1 from the good old fashioned uh, Morningstar. See, we almost did it there. It's a, it's a really, really good item. Boom, look at that. It's so good. I don't know what tier it is. I hope it's like uh, A tier, S tier in that general vicinity. What is going on? Non-rainbow. You better believe I ain't going to take nothing in a non-rainbow package. No siree, Bob. But anyway, I just like, you know, I wanted a power trip today. Oh, that always happens. We just, we just can't make it up there in time. There's nothing I can really... Yeah, there's nothing I can really do. I think that maybe if we killed that first enemy slower, the second wave only spawns when you kill one enemy, maybe? I'm not positive on that. I'm like, I'm totally making it up. I'm pulling it out of my caboose, out of my keister, out of my tush. But I think that there's a lot of phases, you know, there's a lot of phases that only spawn when a certain amount of enemies are dead. When you kill your first enemy or kill a certain enemy. Oh, pop up. Do we have table tech sight? What the hell is that? Game slowed down for a second. I guess, I think it's just because we, yeah, we were literally just walking along an, an edge. Go home, I'm drunk. But I am home. And I'm not drunk. I'm just like this. Nothing uh, to really care about in the shop there. We don't need a key. Don't need nothing. Don't need a key. Don't need nothing. I said I don't need a key. <laughs> Rainbow mode keys, just, they're largely irrelevant. They're not completely irrelevant. You know, there's some scenarios, there's some items that you can get value out of them. There's always, like, locked rooms and such, but the fact of the matter is, on a Rainbow Run, the vast majority of your keys are unnecessary. You only need, like, you need, like, a third or a fourth as many keys. So if you don't have enough keys for what you need... Either you're really early on in the run, or you're spending your keys on weird things. Or your luck is ridiculously bad. Come on. AoE, AoE, AoE. I guess we don't need it. That boy was our AoE. That boy was our AoE. Come on. <laughs> yeah, okay, I like my decision. I like my decision. Can't really do anything with that on a rainbow mode run. It's pretty much irrelevant. It's an irrelevant. Bit by bada no stop. All right. You must die, my friend. You must die. But I, I, I mean, I want to get it, the one problem with rainbow mode and mod the gungeon is. I want to pick up the modded stuff really badly. 
Oh, hey, but... And I will pick up... The, no, here's the issue. I will pick up the modded stuff. That's the issue. And a lot of times, y you know, it might not even be great. It's just modded. And we kind of have to deal with it. We have to make the run out of it. This is a situation where I knew that item was really good. Big, big laser. It's very good. And it kind of helps us in the situation where we can uh, we can be using a terrible gun and it might not be a terrible situation, you know? Oh! <laughs> the way that it was like... He was slowly all pushed back. Oh my god. You hate to see it. You love to hate to see it. But the beam lasts for quite a quite a while. It does actually track our uh, track our mouse still too, which is nice. God, it's such a strong item. Such a like look at that. That's our standard item. It might as well be like boss bullets or whatever the hell. You know? Know what I'm saying? I'm gonna buy one extra one of those, even though we don't we probably won't need it. I do just want to make sure if there's anything locked that we want access to, we can get it. Patience. I've got it. Mostly. There we go. For the most part, I'm patient. As of right now. But alas, down we go. I, uh, a bunch of people were wondering how, <laughs> I might as well mention it, ooh. Ooh, woo, hold on. Obviously, oh, high dragon fire, pick it up, but we've actually been doing a lot of high dragon fire runs here. You can take a peek at a bunch of the other ones. I just wanna check, what even is, what's that? What is that? Have I had it before? Is it useful? So I don't want to pick it up if it literally won't do anything for us. Uh, Repository improves damage of cursed weaponry. I don't have any cursed weaponry. Let's go with this one. Yes, I know. Makeshift cannon, though. Look at this. The synergy on this lad. It's so good. It's so good. And I think that, to an extent, we won't have too many, uh, too many ammo issues with it as long as we force reload. You know, like to, to cancel the reload a little bit earlier there. I think it'll be all right, all right, all right. But obviously, like, ammo things would be wonderful pickups. Get out of here, you punk. Oh, you love to see it. You love to see it. Where is that stanker? Not you. There we go. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it. Good start to a run. Laser run. Extreme laser run. Turning into a robot robomation. Robot Mation 2.0. Lich Borg 9000. There we go. It's kind of what I was just fishing for. God, I love it. Ugh. It's such... It's one of the best... Or I don't know if it's one of the... It's not one of the best guns to get as Gunslinger. It's a really nice one to get as Gunslinger, but it's probably one of the most satisfying ones to get as Gunslinger. It's just like the synergy is very, very good. I think it's a combination of two synergies. Because I think that I've had it with just Scattershot before and it's slightly underwhelming. There we go. Oh, heck. Can't get in there. And slightly underwhelming on its own. Man, what a world. Doing a run where we got normal movement speed, normal dodge. It is an absolute dream. Doink. Doink ba doink. But yeah, I, I think it's one of the I think it's the sound effect, the colors, the visual, bouncy shots are always you'll love to see it. 
bouncy shots are always just a great thing to have in any game ever. <laughs> I mean, that's not lit that's literally not true. I'm sure I could even think of a couple off the top of my head if I felt like it. But, I mean, yeah, question of the day. What's a game? <laughs> you know, okay, let let's let's make a game out of it. Not what's a game that has bouncy shots that they're bad in. I mean, let's extend it. What game... What game, or if you can't think of any, media property do you think would be funny if it had bouncy bullets? What, which one do you think would, would be uh, not a great fit for bouncing bullets? I would love to hear it. One, okay, got one key to do that if we want to. We could leave our friends behind. I would love piercing shots too. I think that, uh, like, I love piercing shots, I love bouncing shots just in all scenarios. Like, I mean, there's gotta be like a, a really, like a ooh, very poignant drama where if all of a sudden the, like, the protagonist shoots a bullet at the, uh, at the, you know, the antagonist or whatever, and then all of a sudden. It bounces off, bounces off the wall because they miss, and it just bounces right back to them. There's got to be, got to be a great scene where that would happen. Boyo, <laughs> like that famous scene from the OC where spoiler sh shoots that spoiler, and then she just. And then she dies. Wouldn't that be crazy if she just... if Wouldn't that be crazy if she died in the OC? Wouldn't that be crazy? All people who this is very clearly going to land with. <laughs> very clearly. It's okay. It's not for you. It's not for you. I just want to make a... I want to make a reference every episode that... Not that that's a deep cut at all. I want to make one, like, sneaky, sneaky, deep cut reference every time. So people just can slowly figure out exactly every piece of media I've ever consumed. Like, out, even, like, the weirdest, most out there things. You know? That would be just slowly the puzzle piece of the man that I... Puzzle pieces for the man that I am. Slowly become one. Slowly become whole. You can combine all the references, like pieces of Exodia, and, uh, okay, this is, this is hilarious. This looks like a secret button in a, in a video game. But yeah, like Exodia, it forms me. I will show up in your house when you collect all of the references. Well, the, the funniest thing is when... I get people saying, I mean, because it's like, people just pick up references without knowing it, too. So the best is when I just, like, I'll make a reference to a thing that I haven't seen on accident, just because I say, like, I say a phrase that someone says in that. I can tell you one thing right now. If I've ever, quote-unquote, made a reference to an anime, I haven't. It was an accident. I, I, I'm not anti-anime. I just... Like I, I've said a million times, I I don't have like a lot of time to watch anything, and I've participated in the watching of some anime, and and I enjoyed myself, but it's really easy to just chop off like a whole section of media, like a whole a whole collection of media just in one fell swoop to save myself some time. Like, I don't have enough time to watch all uh, everything I want to watch right now, play every game I want to watch right now. If I can chop off a whole section and make my decision-making easier, I'm going to do it right now. So, I, I ain't going to start right now. But, yeah, it's if there's ever been, quote-unquote, an anime reference, it was not on purpose. Not on purpose. Sorry to get your hopes up. Oh, pop. Maybe one day, when I am retired, I will catch up on the 2,000 anime recommendations that everyone lays out to me. 
It's the number one thing. I I, I joke. I've joked about it before. Uh, like, because one of the things that gets tracked is obviously YouTube comments and uh, and uh, Twitch Twitch chatters are all pretty relevant. I don't know what the hell that thing is in the bottom left. I feel like it's a risk of rain. I don't know that I've ever had it. Uh, but like, so chatters and uh, and comments, you know, they matter. What is it? Uh, I have two fists, but only one shoots. Originally designed for loading dock operations, this exoskeleton has been heavily modified for close combat use to enhance strength and speed, and the shield generator module of the suit have been enough to allow the owner to survive through a crash landing and be stuck in a time loop on a hostile planet. Surely it'll serve you well in the Gungeon too. Equip boxing glove or Casey to activate. Hitting enemies with your equipped weapon has a chance to spawn a Guan Stone that will be destroyed in one hit doing a small blank effect in the process. Holy mother of God. Ooh, okay. That visual, the visual on that is super cool. It's funny that we have, <laughs> that we got two punchers, but we only punch with one, maybe. The hell? We charged up. I don't know, it seems seems pretty good. It's just the boxing glove, though. Does it have a damage up? I mean, yeah. Charge multiplier... Charge multiplier 5 bajillion. Okay, so we can, like... Every... That's why it's stronger. Every shot is a fully charged shot. Our speed goes up like crazy while we're holding it. Roll distance is better. Wait, weird. The roll distance barely changes, but it seems really good. I, I'm, I, I like. I don't know. I, I dig it in a way. There's a little bit of goofiness to it. I will totally admit. Like we got a we got a ton going on. It's 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 like a, a paragraph and a half to explain what the heck it even does, but I'm happy to like I'm happy to to have it and use it right now. It feels really slick. Like and the boxing glove being good is honestly has been a dream of mine. There we go. I was like, I think we can probably break this. Yeah, is it fully... It should be fully charged. I don't even remember what the fully charged thing does with it. This little effect behind us is so cool looking. What? What? Is that because we got the super punch? Because that, that's the thing. Yeah, if we... Oh my god. Also, we do need to try Casey with it if we can. Like, getting the guaranteed, the easy peasy super punch. Yeah, that's it right there. That's, it's totally fully charged every time. Oh my God. Oh my God. We're, oh my God, we're busted. My only wish is that both of the gloves punched. I don't know how possible that is. But that's my only desire, is if both of the gloves could punch. Because it's it's cool looking. Oh, man, and the dodges are amazing. I bet you the Casey situation is, is the same there. Probably a dual wheel, but you swing one. Oops. That was very good. So you lose your stars when you take damage. Including falling in a pit. Boink. Boink. There we are. 
yeah, I'm liking it. I'm digging it. So it's a little bit wacky. It's a little bit long-winded in its in its explanation of what it is. Like it's a it's like a combination of two items, kind of. But it's cool. I'm and I'm glad we picked it. And in action, it's not in action. It's not janky. It's it's more just like the fact that it feels like it's two or three items in one. It's like the. I, I guess that's so that it's not useless. Not useless if you don't have the item, but it gives you the item. Oh! But I cannot tell you how excited I am to have a boxing glove run that doesn't suck. Like the fully, like the fully charged up shots immediately is so slick. Double puncher. It looks so silly, especially since one of them doesn't go. I don't know if it's a bug or if it's just uh, if, if it just can't really be done or what. But I would live for that to be changed. Oh, that damage! It good. I want to get in. Punch snake. Punch snake. Punch snake. Uh, ah. Oh god, he's got the move speed up. I mean, so do I, I guess, to an extent. Hey, yo. Ah, ah, yes! Bad? No. Good? No bad. No good? We get boss damage 2x, that's why. I didn't even see that. Oh, that. What the hell? What? What the hell? There's another feature to this? God, this is just like... This is just actually turning you into a mech. I swear. Holy moly. Like, it should full on... This should just be a character, honestly. Well, not really, it'd be OP. But still, what are we gonna do to make this crazier? The glass of water is actually not too strong, so I'm probably gonna pass on it. I'm thinking yellow chamber for rate of fire and HP and such. Yeah. I think so. We're almost out of ammo. God, the laser beam too. It's just, it's just wacky. Do we have the ability to, uh... no, we don't have the ability to do it unless we're holding the gloves. That's so goofy. Wow, wow. It just straight up gives you a new ability on, uh, if you don't know, I'm pressing the, uh, the reload button. Interesting. Oh, I thought somebody was left. Just going up. Uppercut. Oh, the turkey. <laughs> I was like, what's going on? Yep. <laughs> oh my god whoa that's so weird but it actually like I don't know it doesn't feel bad for some reason which is the weirdest thing I wonder if it counts as a dodge like I wonder if we get iframes is basically all I'm getting at there let's find out it does Oh my god, it's really cool. Because what I like about it is that we do get our dodge. We, we do get our dodge still. 
So if it's annoying or it's like too far, it doesn't take the place of our normal dodge. That's what's really nice. We're busted, dude. It's crazy. On top of the fact that we get to use it like a lot. Oh, this room is something. That something is bad. There we go. Uh, let's get a blank in here if we can. Thank you. Down we go. Mecca, mecca, mecca. Right, right. Cause it's, I mean, it's kind of like a dual wheel. Okay. I was trying to use the uh, the special dash just to see if we could. Yeah, we can. Could we? I feel like I had a feeling. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Who needs it? So we could probably, because yeah, I, I was going to say, I had a feeling, because I think it's, you know, it's the same kind of teleporter as uh, Bloodied Scarf, it looks like. Uses some of the same effect, at the very least. So, I mean, I figured that there was a pretty good chance that it would just uh, break, be able to break anything we wanted. Hell, like, we could maybe even get through a door if we did it right. Super worth it. Oh my god. What? What? We can like yeet them by dashing into them. We it actually is an uppercut. Okay. Alright, well. Uh yeah. I don't know that I recommend it since it brings them with us. I feel like if it didn't bring them with us, it'd be better for us, for our uh, our well-being. But if we can do that, I think we can use it as like a finisher. Oh my god. <laughs> this is crazy. It's really cool. Of all the janky-ish items... It's, like, not that janky. It's only janky in concept. It actually is fluid, which is what's crazy. You'd hear all these mechanics, and you'd think that this wouldn't... I don't know. I would I would assume it, that it wouldn't work. But it's like a full-on new moveset. Because we still have our dodge. That's, what, that's my favorite thing about it, is that we still have our dodge. With the movement... I love it. Boxing glove, but good, though. Gives us a new move set. Bam! Hey, hey! Oh, <laughs> we sent him straight to hell. Meow. Set. Yo. Hello. Okay. Might as well get the HP, and we will go down to the rats. There's a rainbow chest we get. I had a feeling. Ow. <laughs> I had a feeling. That my chair is broke as hell. My chair is broke. Unlike my tooth anymore. Thank you for those who were curious and hoped it went well. It went it went totally fine. I no longer have a crater in my mouth. I now have. I am now basically part unhuman. What do we... Uh, what 
What does that one do again? Is that the uh, the the eye? Is that? Ah, that's the one where we turn them into our friends. That's pretty meme -y. This would keep us alive. This just gives us a lot of a consumable, which is not really relevant right now. Also, synergy? Hmm. Synergy. Charge up our punch on the little rats here. Any more? All right, up, up, down, right, down, up. Doink. Oh, we got the infinite. We got the infinite bug. Yes. Don't mind if I do. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. All right. All right. Up, up, down. Oh my god. Is it like what happens when we get a, uh, a rat with it or something? Next is right. Oh god. Get! Yeah. Oh my stupid friend. Down up, I think. Not positive where we are in the whole, the whole spiel. Hey yo! Yeah yo! Bop, 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 bop. But yeah, anytime we kill an enemy, we turn them into our own friend. I think I might have gone the wrong way. No, I didn't. Too much of a, a large-brained individual. <laughs> he says. Jokingly and hoping under people understand. Oh my god. Oh! Oh, I thought I could dash through all cool, like. Hell! I mean. It's pretty cool! It's pretty cool! Ah! Why would I? <laughs> my only issue with it is why would I want to use any other gun ever in the uh, history of my life? It's like the Gunther scenario where I probably wouldn't want to just keep on using this forever after uh, you know we got used to used to it more. Oops. But yeah, I guess this is why we would use anything else. Doink. Can we, uh, mega punch it? Yup. Bye. This is a ridiculously cool and crazy run. I wouldn't be shocked if there was some kind of gunslinger synergy going on with the boxing club, but I actually don't think that there... I don't think it has any. Ah! Waiting for the cooldown. The cooldown is, is what the, uh the yellow glows about. Hey, oh, up, up, up. Yeah, it's, it just feels so right. It took me a while to understand that it had that extra ability, but dang, man. And here I thought all of the things it did were already like a little over the top and then you know it gives me this extra crazy thing we can do with the the bonus dash and everything very cool we don't get any of these items don't get excited apache made it so if you have expand the gunjdan you don't get rat items you don't get the rainbow items you don't get the rat items in rainbow mode is what i meant to say the, the ones that show up on the sides. I almost wish we just couldn't see them, you know? Hello. Boop, 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 boop. Two. 
Get out of here. Oh, uh, love seeing fortune's favor as an item that we don't get. Never going to be sad about that, unless it gets a buff from one of the packs. Which I don't think it will. Maybe not. Oh, not getting eye level. It's oh, Apache. The dream. Oh, you hate to see it. We could just like give ourselves all the items, I guess. Like that's, I, I suppose, a true fact. But oh well. Just to show we can't open those up. For a quick reminder. Whip. Next. What would we want now? I mean, duct tape would be hilarious. <laughs> I, could we? I mean, we could duct tape another glove onto our glove, I guess. Uh, what is that one? Is that the one that does a pool of fire or something? It's a, it's a risk of rain item. So where are all those? There. Chance to leave a huge pool of poison on hit, poison immunity. I mean, yeah, yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. Fat bullets. Wait, does it make, does it actually make the glove bigger up there? No. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're going to, we are going to use, oh my God. We're gonna use this until it's out of ammo. We're gonna throw it to make it huge. And then we are gonna have large gloves. Or at least one big hand and one small hand, which would be honestly equally as funny. We are absolutely destroying everything. Oh my God. Yep. Pop through the door. You're mine now. Can't tell which ones are. Can't tell which ones are my friends when they're jammed. <laughs> we literally we punch them into being our friends. What kind of message is that sending to the youth of the gungeon? I love how we literally just shoot out like a giant blasphemy sword. Thanks. Boy. We dash through them and we kill them in one swift motion. They literally just become our friend. Just like that. <laughs> uh, got our super punch yet? Nope. We can, can we charge up our super punch by killing our friends? Yeah, we can. But we have to be careful because we are miss. We are wasting our super punch. But like, it's such a fast fire thing that I feel like it's not worth it to conserve yeah we can we can charge it up ah, on our friends which is very great can we do the we can do the dash roll to give ourselves a little bit of extra immunity at the end of that <laughs> I love when they die and then they uh, they are on screen before their corpse is gone it's great your friend, your friend. I like what the biggest shock to me today is how much this is not bugged to hell. But my only question is literally, am I supposed? Okay, we don't even get anything from that. My only question is, am I supposed to be punching with both both fists? That's my only question. Also, why are we doing so well for ammo? I guess it's just because this is a really high ammo efficiency gun. And I just never know because 
why would I? I? Just don't use it very much. I feel like it might give us contact immunity too, which would be great. I'm not. I don't think so, actually. Well, eh, we took a bunch of damage there, but I'm not sure. It's kind of hard to. Yeah, it's kind of hard to tell. It's kind of hard to tell. Because them stinkers are just gonna kill you with the bullets instead. We're getting down to low HP. Womp. Thanks. Come on now. Get rid of all that ammo business. I don't want none of that ammo, son. Don't want none of that ammo, son. I will give myself ammo as soon as we get to the bottom because we're just... We're cheesing. We're memeing. If the shop could have... If the shop had ammo, oh. If the shop had ammo, that'd be something. It does. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I don't know where we're coming down. 7, 6, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Oh, that's not good. One big hand and one small hand. You love to see it. <laughs> uh, I something tells me the hitbox did not grow. Which honestly mate The hitbox did not did not grow. It <laughs> didn't grow at all. Alright. That may actually cause some issues. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god, my ghoul. It's so good. I am a mecha. Yoink. Oh, that's nice. Nice new added little room there. And we're off. We up. Infinite ammo. I don't think we need it. Osteoporosis bullet storm charge. We already have infinite charge time. Instant kills on skeleton creatures and super crazy damage against the lich is hilarious. Uroboros, I mean, infinite ammo though. Let's put it on. This is just, it's got such a good ammo economy anyways. I don't know if I care. You know, like if it if it had a bad ammo economy, I kind of regret it. But infinite ammo. Also, I do regret making our our puncher big, since it does not make the hitbox big. Because it's making it really hard to tell who I could actually hit. I got to use my memory about what the hitbox is supposed to be. This is one of those days where we're super OP and because of it we're going to we're going to get ourselves killed because we aren't taking the run seriously in any way. Cuz like how could I take this run seriously? Look at it. Punch him until he becomes your friend. Punch him until he becomes your friend. Whoa. Yeah, I mean, this with infinite ammo is just a dream. Okay, well, I mean, like, I kind of want to do it, you know? What do you mean I got a jam dragon Pikachu face? I mean... I mean... I mean, 
It's Goof Town. Yoink! I mean, like, what's a run where you actually get to use the boxing glove on the Lich? On the, well, I mean, we'll probably, well, uh, let's be real, we're gonna use it on the Lich, too. Watch us have ammo issues. We're at 70 now. This, you're gonna think I'm crazy. This actually might end up being a little goofy with our dodge roll. No, no, I mean, well, first of all, the blank crystals are doing work from the exoskeleton. I'm gonna do mostly for the next floor mostly for that next floor there oops whoop I mean this is like god I love it it's so good it's so good the only thing is that yeah I guess I thought that it had okay ammo economy but it really it, it, it really does not have a great one because it just unloads the bullets so quickly. I know we don't need to do this. Oh, he's got. Oh, look at him! He's rocking a red face and a purple bowed. Oh, thank you. This is speedrun territory. I mean, if oh, I tried to use my uh, my dash when I didn't have my glove out. And the fact the the fact that we can do the the dash, oh my God, my boys, my boys. Sorry, you got you're causing more trouble than you're worth. I mean, I hate this room. Oh wait, the room's done. All right, well, there's no real, there's no point to even do it. No point. Uh oh, ladies and gentlemen, the memes, the memes are taking over. The memes are taking over. Let's fight back. Yeah. Whoop. This is, it's too fun of a run to like, to take seriously is the issue. Too fun of an item to take, to take anything we're doing seriously. I just want to dash around everywhere. It's, it's like that first run you get the alien engine ever. Uh, okay. It's like that first run you ever get the alien engine. You're like, I need to use this entirely. Also, I'll be honest, the uh, the friend copy situation always causes a little bit more chaos than it causes help. So that's probably a little bit of a of a factor as well here. A little creepy. Get the hell out of here now. Ba -da 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 -da. Also, it's hard to tell when the rooms are actually over. It's out of ammo. We gotta do this now. We don't gotta do this now. Thank you. I don't know why I cared to do that. I guess this could have uh, could have HP in it. Sir, sir. You are not a help. You are you are supposed to be my friend. I was originally not gonna dodge that. I this this is like this item. Every time I have it, I start taking damage all over the place. It is chaos run incarnate. All over the place, I take that damage.
This is insanity. I can't, I can't not use it, but it's just, ah. <laughs> oh God. What a day, what a freaking day here. We'll, we'll do that so we can have a finished run. But it's just like, the amount of bodies, the fact that your friends body block you is kind of the big, the big issue I have here. I'm just, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I wanna go. And we're obviously going to full clear bullet hell without taking a hit. Can we not dash in here? We can't dash in here. We do have one little little puncher, the extra puncher. Down we go now. Bullet hell now. I'm a mech, I'm gonna die. You will see. Seven curse too. 1.76 damage with a puncher. I mean, metronome laser rifle sounds hilarious. All right, but this is what we're going to do. We're doing it. Here's my issue with this, is that we need to not get hit for the metronome to be good. And my other issue is that my dang freaking hands aren't right. It's not actually where it says it is. We could use the dash just as a, uh, a bonus dodge here. That could be good. Just like as a, as a safety tool. Doesn't count as killing him with the glove, with the dash. This is a mess. This is an absolute mess. But we can get we can get double killed. We can kill the same. Yeah, we're not close enough. Ignore the fact that we are hitting the enemy. We're not close enough. <laughs> this is dumb. This is so dumb. This is so dumb. I love it. I hate it. I love it. Doink. Whoop. Oh, we summoned a jammed one as our friend. Uh, did we go the long way? We might have gone the long way. <laughs> if we got tiny bullets, could we sh re shrink it back to the normal size? I feel like we probably could, huh? I feel like we probably could. Oh boy. Glad we have the super crazy dash move because this room can just can bite my butt when you get these guys as your uh, as your rolled big boy enemy. Oh my god, it's such a such a freaking chaos run, dude! Such a mess. Everything's a mess. We have infinite laser. I don't know why. And it's huge. Oh my god, everybody's dead. But also my friend, but also they're still here, but also they're gone. But they're definitely still in my way and all of it looks like enemies. That's the issue. Everything looks like enemies still. You know what? Why have I not thought about it that way? God, I, this room is basically nine rooms at once sectioned off into little quadrants. I mean, they would non non drints non 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 drints There's nine of them that's when we get that. How did I do it so far? When it When do I become absolute king? of this exosuit. Oh god. I can't see. I can't see. <laughs> I can't see. My laser's too big. My laser's too big. Oh my Jesus Christ. This is something. Uh I had to think about the correct path there. The path of least room resistance. 
Do we have two lasers? What's going on? What is happening today? Okay, okay. Down, right, okay. Get out of my life. Psst. Roll right into it, why not? If we wanted to have an easy run, we'd probably just use this and stack it up with the infinite, infinite of metronome. Maybe we'll do it for a couple rooms here. And by easy, I mean I can't see anything! I can't move! They body block me! I can't move! I cannot move! I needed to switch to my special dash. I can't see anything. I needed to switch to my special dash just to get out of that corner. Oh my god. This is just... This is a crazy, crazy run. We have two lasers! Let me leave. I don't care about the metronome. I don't care about it one bit. But yeah, we could stack this up on our friends as well. I love Infinilaser. Except for when I want to see my screen. That's the only time where I just don't... Oh, don't love it. Uh, okay, we're done. Eh! Upper... <laughs> can't, can't see my map because of the contrast, the, the laser beam. It's ridiculous. Ah! It's because of fat bullets and, and the bug together. Oh god, this room is very, very... Yeah, okay. We... Yep, yep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Definitely fun with friends. Definitely fun with the friends. <laughs> oh my god. This... Freaking day, man! We keep on getting crazier situations than the last. Alright. We're gonna use the punching glove against the, the boss anyway, so I don't care if we have, like, three metronome stacks. Get out of my way. You're, you are my enemy more than the enemies are my enemy. Mr. We done yet? We're done yet. There's apparently HP around. I can't see anything though. There's one. Did I get? I think I got a hit. I don't think I need this other HP, but you know, this is chaos. So I mean, I might as well. Am I right? Up I go then. Oh god. <laughs> oh, we we did have it. Okay, he's got the homing shot though. Yeah! <laughs> it's so dumb, I love it. Yo! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why not? Let's just we're we're doing this now. We have to. Don't talk to me or my fist stuff again. Uh. I don't know if that did damage. It would be cool if it did. Yeah. I don't think so. I did. Yep. Wacky item. Crazy day. I am a mecha map. Yes, this is where I should be. The place where I can see the screen. These little, like, crystals, too. The craziest thing about this item is that I don't hate it. That's that's the craziest thing. Going in! Stand here, why not? Oh my god. 
That's gonna do it for the day. Oh my Jesus. Oh my golly. Thank you everybody for watching this monstrosity. I <laughs> greatly appreciate it. Anything else for you? We should leave on series up at this point. With an extra special thank you to DX, Throwbone, and Delrick, Justice, Tom, The Shogun, Gun, More Than Awesome, Semicolon, P, and Patricia for supporting our Patreon and the Go Team Gungeon tier, helping me do this full time at a time where I could not otherwise. Thank you to them and all of the other Patreon supporters over there who are getting all kinds of different rewards and helping keep the channel running at a time where, you know, things are a bit, a bit spicy. So thank you to them, thank you to you for watching, and thank you to everybody for liking. It takes half a second. And it tells the algorithm that I make videos worth watching and that I should be able to keep doing this. And other people should maybe see it. So thank you, thank you. Dear God. And I will see you next time.